Hey, how's it going, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the Samuel channel. Um, hey, you guys, I'm back. Uh, I'm still alive. And I, in fact, uh, I was back uh, around like 2 a.m. in the morning, and now it's around 12. And um, right now, I'm doing an unboxing. This time, I prepared a lot of money and I bought a lot of things that you need to see. So, as I previously said at the New Year video, this year I'm starting MG series, so of course this video is gonna include MG. So let's not talk too much. So let's for our number one, that's our Gus L. So somebody will ask why you bought this P band. It's not even that famous. Well, actually, if you watch the Double Zeta, you know that um, the final battle is actually one of my favorites. So you know the massive battle where uh, Zeta, uh, Gulemi, and then Hamans army were fighting together the, uh, the three fighting together that one was my favorite so this is one of my favorite units because i i always feel like this guard unit is very cool and you know this one right here is pretty cheap if you buy it at ebay or in australia i think it costs about 99 99 uh it costs about 90 to 100 in my memory and this one i pick it up with 300 xkd which is around 50 or 60 dollars aud if you really want to count it anyway i'll put the change rate at the you know at the top corner or something like that so move on next so we got the sand rock so sand rock right here is a pretty new thing i picked this i picked this up with like 85 dollars xkd which is pretty cheap as well so this is um you know this is a new this is very new but the box is kind of squished so that's why it's so cheap and you know i really wish that they give you the machine gun but they didn't include it in this kit so i assume it's going to be like a p band i think all right next we have the this is pretty hard to find okay it took me it took me a quite a while to find this though so this is the space uh jim cannon space assault type so this p band i for some reason nobody likes it so not much shops or sellers actually got the actual product so i have to run around a lot of places to try, uh, try to get it but and anyway i found this so i bought this with hazel 2 for 450 xkd so you know hazel 2 as well so here you go uh i didn't plan to buy the big one because i was waiting to get the final version where the tr6 have everything on it i was waiting to get that so i'm not gonna buy the big one right now so anyway hazel 2 and jim cannon and next, 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 we have Mudrock. So Mudrock, if you've been playing PS2 in your life, if you played PS2 in your life, you must play a game called Zionic Front, right? So Zionic Front uh, is where this mobile suit came from. Uh, I don't think this is like an official history or anything. There's not much people, there's not much people know about the existence uh, like after four or five because most people well know about geo 4 and geo 5 and geo 6 geo 7 nobody really know them unless you're like a very unless you're a person that like universal century so much but i actually uh like to play this game since i was a child so that's why i bought it it's like a it's like a childhood memory or something like that but anyway next so next we got zack and v so i don't really know what second v is coming from it's more like if you've been what if you watched uh high new and news comparison so it's more like a para paralyzed universe thing so this is in the manga there's no v2 it was used second v instead of uh v2 gundam so this is more like a v2 ab but with a little bit different things so it's very hard to explain it's like it only appeared in the manga so nobody really knows this unit even myself So next up, we have all three Koa Gundams. So Earth 3, Earth 3, and uh, this one, V2, and Mars 4. I got all of it. Mars 4, I got the weapons as well, but V2, unfortunately, I couldn't find it at uh, Hong Kong because it was selling so quick, I can't even get my hands on this. So I ordered it on eBay, so it will probably around at the end of January or something like that. So if you want to see the Core Gundam review, you're going to have to wait, okay? So next up, we have the 
RG Shinanju. So Shinanju, I bought it with uh, two, 220 XKD, I believe. Uh, I do have the expansion set that I bought around two years ago. I hope the expansion set is not, uh, is not broken yet because, you know, if you put plastic for too long, it will start to get a little bit uh, softened up or broken up or whatever you want to say it. So, you know, I bought this quickly just to mess around. But, you know, I do know the frame that has got problem because Shinanju have a very common thing is called uh, the waste is is trash. Okay, I know that. So, you know, I'm taking a bit risk, but it's beautiful. So I think I'm just gonna put it on stand and just leave it alone. I think. <clears throat> Next up, we got red frame. If you watch my last year big uh, unboxing at the early of the year, I got this uh, because I got the BTF. Uh, what's that called? The Kai weapons, Kai weapons and actions. So this is, this is basically why I need this. So I or I forgot to tape this around, so I'm just gonna briefly open it to you like this. So you know, nothing really special to look at. So skip it to next. So next up, I have the X Year Repair Free. So the X Year Repair Free, I bought this very cheap as well, two thirty XKD. This is per basically the lowest I can get. So actually repair free, I, many people ask why I don't buy repair two because I feel like repair two don't have really much difference but repair free um, from the outside look of it, it give me it gave me more reasons to buy because it got at least it got like a cannon that is for me is completely new so it did give me some reasons to buy it but repair two I'll think about it. So next up a brand new thing sell some so why I bought this unit because it's cool. A lot of people said it's weird. A lot of people say it's ugly, but you know, uh, spoiler alert. So South Sum actually uses a new mode. So XGUZ Gundam Mark III is coming in the way. So just wait for a while. So next up, we I'm saving up like the best thing in the lot. So first we got RG new effect set. So I bought this with 330. So uh, it is pretty good. The reason why I don't do a uh, new Gundam when I first get it because uh, I was waiting for this X, uh, effect set coming out. If you have this effect set, remember, do not buy the double vein funnel set. The double vein funnel set is just giving you a water slide decal, six more uh, funnels, and the funnel effect set, and the action base. So if you don't mind about stickers, um, you already got the, the action base and the funnel effect part in this, so don't spend your extra money on the double vein funnel expansion set. Wait for it to get XWS, okay? XWS is more important than double vein funnel. Plus, I don't think double vein funnel looks pretty anyway, and double vein funnel right now is pretty expensive. It's pretty expensive, so I really recommend you to gamble on it because you, when you bought this effect set, you basically have everything that double vein funnel provides, so there's no point for you to get another one. Next, next, next. I'm saving the best thing for the last. So first, Dragon Formation Base. I can't find this anywhere on, like, on the uh, on Carousel or Yahoo Auction. Uh, but I do find it in a model shop, and the boss is, um, you know, pretty friendly to me. Uh, we are kind of like, we're kind of like friends, and I always go there. So. A uh, special thank to Chico Hobby. Search them on eBay. They basically got like the best P Bandai selection for you because they have a lot of P Bandai. They have variation of HG, RG, MGs. Um, they got a lot, a lot, a lot of options of Pyrenean Bandai. And you know, their shipping maybe seem a little expensive, but I think for the actual P Bandai price, you pro they are possibly the cheapest on uh, eBay. And this one right here is their last last set in there. They didn't put it on eBay to sell it to me because uh, I asked for it. Okay, so special thanks to Chico Hobby. Go check them out. Uh, go check them. Uh, go go check their eBay store out. So, you know, I'm just promoting for a friend. Okay. So next up, so as previously said, I'm starting MG series. So first up, we have PG, uh, I mean, not PG, MG Providence. So right here, right now, it can't even fit in my camera. So um, I bought this. I don't have the effects set because I can't find it anywhere else. Not even Chico Hobby provides them. So, so I just bought the, you know, very, uh, I just bought the, 
uh, the first company made Doragon unit, which I will show on the screen right now. It looks like this. Uh, the parts I won't show you now. I will just, you know, save it as a surprise when I build this Providence. Uh, if you ask me, I'm gonna paint. If I'm gonna paint the MG or not, definitely yes, I will paint it. But I really need to check on my time schedule right now. So, yeah, that's it. So next up, we have the last thing that you will like. 2.0 Freedom plus the expansion set. So the expansion set, I get this bowl for 330 HKD. That's very cheap because considering this thing, this ring, just four beams and a water slide decal costs like 200 or 150 dollars HKD. It's insane. And then Freedom, it costs about 280 around. You know, if you if you buy this, it costs around 280 or something like that. So I think I got this pretty cheap. So you know, I just I just bought it. So. Honestly, man, uh, if you want to display this thing, I think you're gonna need a, I think you're gonna need a big shelf because the effect part plus the freedom's wings plus the whole plus the action base, you know, make it taller or something like that. You're gonna need to make sure your shelf can go in. Okay, I have a little bit problem about that, so I'm gonna just I'm just gonna buy a separate shelf to uh, display it. So that's basically everything that I bought. I bought around one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So I bought about 18 box of Gunpla. So it's pretty insane this time. So I will let you do the calculate. Uh, I will let you do the calculation on how much I spend. So this is the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed this. So, you know, stay, uh, stay focused on my reviews and uh, I will be making them as soon as possible. But uh, anyways, so thank you for watching. Thank you for your support. I um, hope you have a good 2020 star just like me okay goodbye